Hello everyone, it's me, Heidi, DIY Nails by Moi, and if you follow me on Instagram, you'll have seen a couple of videos up there on my left hand. Um, so I did a 4th of July design for Independence Day here in the United States, and I didn't get my right hand done in time. Um, there is some personal stuff going on around here that I haven't gotten into um, that's kind of taking precedence over a lot of stuff, including doing my nails. So I did the one side, my left hand, which is my non-dominant hand, and I did them long. Um, I had the original intention of doing them as stilettos, but once I got the stilettos on, I took one look and I was like, oh, heck no. There's no way I can live life with nails that long and pointy. So what we wound up with was a very long ballerina. As you can see. So starting with the thumb. This is a Sally Hansen Diamond Strength. It's called Red Velvet is the base. And then we have an ice in silver and the little glitters and the bigger stars are courtesy of Didi Hernandez from Nails and All That Glitters which is a channel here on YouTube. Check her out. She's got some really cool stuff. So there's my thumb. Index finger. This is a blue from BMC. Might be hard to tell. Um, Actually, it's not a polish, it's a stamping polish. I just really, really like the color. It is blue. I know it looks kind of odd in this light, but that's as much as I can do. Uh, and then we have my center finger, which, by the way, is not an homage to the Chicago Cubs or the Dallas Cowboys. It just was something that kind of happened when I was putting the silver on, and I just decided to go with this. So we've got the silver that wraps around, then we've got the white and the red and the blue, and then we have a silver star in the center and then it wraps around, we got a blue slant French tip. And all that blue, again, is from the BMC stamping polish. This is a base of Sally Hansen Color Therapy in Well, Well, Well. It's a ivoryish white and here we're back to the this is I think where the diamond glitter really shines it's really hard to see on this video but let's turn the light on see if that's any better whoa bright bright um, trying to get it to focus without it being all whited out I think that's about the best we're going to do, people. But yeah, you can see how it sparkles. Actually, they all sparkle beautifully in, in the light. It's just gorgeous. Just gorgeous. And then, of course, we come to the pinky, which is exactly the same as the thumb. So it's the Diamond Strength by Sally Hansen in red velvet. And the ice and nails and all the glitters that's what they look like together as a set and turn the light on for that one and then yes i actually did And finish the right hand. I don't have a thumbnail on. There's a reason for that. I'm not going to get into it right now, uh, except to say that I have an issue going on right down here in my aponychium, and I just don't feel comfortable wearing a nail on this finger right now. So I'm just leaving it as is. 
um, otherwise I would have it match the, the thumb on the other hand. So here's the index finger and you may be noticing something a little different and you're right because this nail is the same as this nail. So the nails on my right hand are about two-thirds the length of the ones on my left hand and that's because I'm right-handed and I did put one nail on this one actually full length like on the other hand and I very quickly realized this was not going to work. I could do nothing, 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 nothing with two hands the same. So we have the same design and features. Since this is all freehand, there is some difference. Of course, these nails are shorter. But again, you have the iridescent diamond dust. And we have the red velvet with the ice and the all that glitters. I'm sorry if this is turning out kind of blurry. I apologize. My camera is slowly giving up the ghost here on my phone. But this is what I did to celebrate the 4th of July. So happy birthday, America. Everybody have a safe weekend. I know since 4th of July came in the middle of the week, most of the gatherings are going to go on this, this coming weekend. So we have a lot of vacationers that come to this area where we live. And it gets pretty loud <laughs> with all the fireworks going off. Um, in case you're wondering what the length of these nails is, is they're approximately one inch long. You will notice there's no massive apex. There actually is an apex, but it's where it needs to be. Because where I need the strength is towards the back towards the cuticle area, not here. Because I'm not putting the nail on here. The nail goes halfway down here. So my apex actually is in the back of the nail. That one's a little more like what you're probably used to. This one does not have much of an apex at all. This one's kind of in between. That one's kind of in between. And on my right hand, there is an apex there, but because the nail is shorter, you're not seeing the tapering of it, but there is an apex there. I have to add some more glue to that, that particular little star. It's popping up. So there you have it. Happy 4th of July. Now if you can see on the bottom, there's also glitter underneath. Same on the other hand. There, now you can see it. But it's the same on all my nails that I have decorated. There's silver underneath. The same silver glitter that's on top. I painted it underneath. So when I'm done with this set of nails and I go to change, they're not just going to be infilled. They're going to be removed or I'll have to do something that will accommodate having that silver underneath. One or t'other.
I don't know why the light isn't catching it so well in this set, but it's the same. Same as the other one. So, well, thank you again for watching my video. As always, please hit the like, subscribe, notifications, and I'll see you next time. So, for DIY Nails by Moi, peace.